Hey, my friends, welcome back to some more Buffy and Me. Well, it is a sunny day here in the zombie apocalypse. <laughs> yeah, we're over here at our horde base. Yes, that's where we're at. Yes, we are. And I'm... I left the damn nail gun. Some topsoil. I'll show you why I made some topsoil in a minute. I want to try something out. Well, I, I brought the blocks over I have over at, uh, you know, our airborne house. Set them down there so I could copy them because this is going to sound so foolish. <laughs> Let's see. Nope. That's not where I want to go. Hey, if you did you know you could actually set a, a, a trap door just on a ladder? I didn't know you could do that. I thought you had I always thought you had to have frames all the way around. But you don't. Amazing. Yeah, anyway, um let's go down here. Now watch that thing break and I fall or something like that. Buffy says, Yep, that's just about your luck, old man. I want to um I know this is gonna sound so foolish. <laughs> Buffy is agreeing with me, but she wants to know. We were thinking about modernizing this and going up with it and making this our base. Yes, I know we spent plenty of time fixing up the wind generator. But what do you think? Do you think we could make that work? And then also, let's see, I gotta get this in here. What if we now, okay, now, will that turn back into, into uh, rock, or will it actually be topsoil? Well, there it's topsoil. Okay, what about... Because, you know, sometimes when you dig something up, you don't get topsoil again. You get, oops, like this gravel, right? That's what ends up happening. Yep, see, that's what you're going to get there. So you can't put... I wonder why that does that. That is really frustrating. I mean, not that this has to, has to be, but if somebody could explain that to me, why does that do that? So what is this? Is this asphalt? No, that's dirt. But what is it going to be when I dig it up? You know what I could do is just, just, uh... I mean, I need the clay, so I guess, you know, it's not that big a deal, but... It'd be nice to have a... Yeah, see, look, it goes back in. I, please, somebody explain to me what is going on. Why is it doing that? Oh, that's frustrating. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I could always put down blocks and paint them, right? Can't you? Can't you paint topsoil? That I want. Oh, now I want to check that out. Um, ooh, I want to check that out. But first, I want to because um, this is the day 14, and I thought we would spend a little time upgrading a few things. No, we're not going to do this for the entire video. This will probably be the last horde video I make. And mostly because, well, I enjoy watching people's horde videos. It's nothing that, you know, horde night videos, but. At the same time, how many can you watch? You know, unless I do something really stupid, which, yes, Buffy says I have. I mean, how much, how many times do you really want to watch me do a horde night? I have basically the same base every time, you know, same type of base. I missed a block right there. 
So I was just thinking, well, we'll record day 14. And I mean, I might go ahead and record another night. And if it's really, really, really exciting, you know, something that you guys can go, wow, he is awesome. Yeah, I, I know, I know, I know, Buffy, I know, I know, I know. I don't know if I brought enough concrete with me for everything. And no, Buffy, I can't remember if I turned on the um, cement mixer before we left. I don't remember if I loaded it. Anyway, that's what I was thinking. Maybe we could line this thing in those blocks. Yes, I know. That's a lot of work. Take out this fence, put in, you know, grass down here. Chop out that 5,000 degree, well, not degree, but, uh, Ooh, can I make this jump? Whew. Yes, I can, because Buffy is awesome, and I'm not. Okay, did I bring paint with me? Oh, hell no. Oh, no, I'm going to go ahead and do this. So let's put this in here for now. Uh, where do I want to put that up here? Man, let's see. We'll put that in there, and that in there, and that in there. And then I'm going to continue upgrading as much as I can, and uh, and I will bring you back for Horde Night. And maybe it'll be exciting. Be right back, friends. All right, my friends, we are back. <laughs> Got more concrete being made. We got a tier five quest right over there in that warehouse area. I didn't realize it was that close. That might make it fun. Anyway, <coughs> I think I forgot to tell you the first of this video is that the reason I'm not that I won't make another horde video if I get requested to do it. You see as far as I got. I just um <coughs> They just don't seem to garner that many views anymore. Oh, and I changed these out so I could put my turrets out there, see? And not that I get hundreds of views anyway. I just enjoy the ones I get with you guys. And did I get all of that? Oh, yeah, that was a quest reward. How do you like that for a quest reward? Not that I have rifles or points in it. But while doing this, anyway, so that's, that's what it is, really. Uh, I am... I enjoy making the videos and talking with you guys, especially when the doctor and I are together, you know, and Buffy's along with us. But I think on this end, I'm not going to make too many. I'm not even sure if the doctor and I are going to keep making them. Like I said, just so much you can do and to make them excited. And I have to get really dumb, which is easy for me to do, but... Oop, I forgot to upgrade those. That could be bad. I wonder if, um, getting close, I wonder if they'll cross this river or viaduct or whatever you want to call it. I wonder if they'll walk down and through there. I almost wish I had. Okay, here we go. I did test one of my precious Molotovs that I've got as loot. And you can throw them through there, but you got to throw them straight through. If you hit down below here... Seems to hit the bar every time, and I'm not in the mood to set myself on fire, which reminds me, gets water out in case I set myself on fire. Now, the turrets should make pretty damn quick work of this. The only disadvantage I see of this is uh, I can't watch them running along the racetrack unless I go out here. I see somebody's beating on something somewhere. And that's another disadvantage, I guess, of this design. Boy, they make quick work of it, don't they? Is not being able to see what's going on. Oh, wow, he was right below me. I wonder if my own turret could shoot me by accident. Oh, here we go. I get, you know, I could probably put a little base thing right over here and 
we could watch these guys jump and fall down. Here they come. Oh, see, look up down there, idiots. Oh, wow. I wasn't paying attention. It's a good thing my turrets were. I want to make sure I don't get out of range. Yeah, that's the only bad thing about this design. You don't get to see them run and fall. Wow, we got a bunch of them out there. Now, this, I guess the sniper rifle would be good here. I guess expecting the zombies to be very agile is kind of a, a fool's game, right? I mean, they they really aren't very agile. Thank you. Tommy the turret and Teddy the turret. That's what we're going to call them. Tommy and Teddy. Yeah, Tommy and Teddy the turret. Ooh, dogs, dogs. How did, I was... Oh yeah, see, there he goes, there he goes. Oh, but he fell down. Oh, so did the hazmat guy. Good <laughs> dog, man, you turned that corner too fast. Oh, that dog got close. That dog actually got close. Oh man, did I bring ammo with me? I brought some. But did I bring any more turret ammo? That's what I'm worried about. Ooh, we better go look. I don't think I brought extra turret ammo with me. I need to do a shitload of mining. Oh no, I didn't. Oh boy. Great. Great. I need to do a whole bunch of mining to, uh... Um, let's reload him. I can do the AP ammo. It takes so much lead and concrete that... Oh, I don't want to do that. Anyway, I don't know. I, like I said, I just... I get a ball out of watching these guys fall. I know the doctor does too. He loves the ragdoll effect that these guys do. Oh, we're getting a hell of a dog hard tonight, aren't we? Oh, look at that boy there. He can try hard. I'm coming for your ass. I want to bite you so bad. Are they coming from any other direction? Not yet. Dang it. I want that deer. I need to meet an animal fat. I did put a point into, what is it, living off the land so I can get better seed return on my crops because I got a bunch of stuff made back at there. Air base. Oh, there she comes. There's our sweetie. She's always so happy until she gets shot in the back of the head. Then she's not so happy. Oop. Edgar. Anyway, yeah. I guess what I still like about this game more than anything else is building and. So that's why I was thinking about uh, trying to salvage this thing and build it up and make it look cool. And I wonder if I could shoot that deer and run after and get the stuff and come back before they kill my ass. Which way are they attacking from? I can't can't tell. Well, there there she came. Where did she come from? They're not out there. Oh look, they're down here beating on that car. Uh oh, they're beating on my beating on my stairs. That, that I don't. I'm not happy about.
Oh shit, I set myself on fire. Well, are we surprised by that? No, because I tried to throw through that scaffolding. And you can't throw through the scaffolding. Bunny says, Buffy says, just remember you can't throw through the scaffolding. Yeah, I really expected it. Oh yeah, they will cross. Look at there, see? I was wondering if they would spawn in that water. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, there's one over there, see? Uh, he just fell out of the building over there. She did. Karen, look at him. That's funny. That's funny. Okay. Yeah, I love the Molotovs. Except for when I set myself on fire. Wow, they died from the... From the uh, fire. I should probably be careful in case there's any cops. Got some more loot bags to go after. Watch me step off here and fall right down there. That would suck. Okay, they're beating on something somewhere. Where are they at? Where are they at? That's that's the other reason I wanted to build around here. I want to put some catwalks around here to around the outer edge so we can see what's going on. Hey, hello. Good to see you again. Oh. They really don't like that guy's truck. It's a good thing I upgraded that concrete dinner. I bet I'm going to have to fix that, aren't I? Oh, hello, stupid. I bet I'm going to have to put a stairway going that direction. What do you want to bet? Because he is just not figuring out how to get up here. Yeah. Besides having a catwalk around here probably wouldn't be bad to keep me from uh Uh oh, now why is he shooting? What are you shooting at, sweetheart? What was that all about? What was that all about? It's not damaged. Must have, somehow must have got a zombie to get his attention there or something. Too bad you can't name these, you know, really name them. I think it'd be fun. I could put name tags on them like in um, Minecraft. You know, or Tommy and Teddy, that would be fun. Let's see, what color is this one? This is the normal yellows. Okay, that one's Teddy. And this one is blue. So that, that'll be Tommy. Tommy and Teddy, yeah. That works. Where are you coming from now? Yeah, yeah, how do you like that? Now you're a hot dog. Get it? That's a joke. Hot dog. Hot dog. Is my deer still there? Yeah, catwalks would be very, very useful here to be able to get out along here. Uh oh. No, you're, you're not getting close at all, Mr. P. 
puke out the back of your head, asshole. Oh, hello. Look, he jumped over there. How do you like that? Uh-oh. Tommy and Teddy, you better wake up. I would really like to have the game have a... Or maybe it's the limitation of the PC more than the game, but, you know, having um, um, spotlights reach a lot further, I think, would be cool. If we, or you could light it up, you know, more, because, well, you can see those lights where I put the lanterns there. I guess that isn't too bad. Oh, he finally got here, though he didn't last very long. Oh, they're coming over there, huh? Oh, I see a oh, cop, 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 cop. This could be a nice little, um, this could be a fun little perch though right here. You, know, you can sit on this side with the turrets over there, and then you could watch everything. I guess I really don't care if he ruins the highway there. I really didn't think they would ever cross that aqueduct there, or that water there. Thank you. So there's a cop underneath that bridge. That might be problematic. Because I don't think I got him killed. I didn't see the EXP thing. Here comes another dog. We're getting a lot of dogs in this horde. Uh-oh. Okay. I thought maybe Tommy or Teddy was, oh, my deer's still there, so maybe we can, maybe we can, let's see, do I have my knife on me or did I put it in the chest? All right, we're going to put this up here and this up here. All right, I'm going to run down there and get my deer. Oh, let's see what we got first. Let's see what we got. I can't imagine anything good. Yeah, nothing great, but, you know, hell, is free. Well, I guess it's not really free because we, uh... I'm betting you there's some zombies from Horde Knight stuck in, uh... In that warehouse building. Oh, I need to eat and drink some water, too. Okay, good. All right, my friends. That's my idea. That's what we're going to try to do. Yeah, there's a bunch of Horde Nighters in there, I bet you. All right, take care, friends. And, oh, here they come. They finally figured out how to get around here. Oh, here she comes. I like the hip fire damage you get. They're not as easy to hit at long distance, but still, I love that extra damage. All right, friends, be careful out there. Be safe. Bye-bye.